No way. This guy is a warrior. It's because he straight up dug into his lower abdomen and is eating out his organs. I'm devouring his innards right now. That's how this is happening. What is going on guys? Riot here playing Ark Survival Evolved here on the Scorched Earth map messing around with the play as Dino Mod because it's had a big ass update since the Scorched Earth stuff has been added to the um to the dev kit so we're just gonna go right over here and select basically you can now play as Scorched Earth creatures which a few of those may sound kind of silly seeing as how you can just ride on top of them playing as the Mantis, the Wyverns, the uh the elemental anything all seems kind of silly because you just you could be it's you're just kind of like invisibly on top of them you can't really go into first person or anything that well but you can with a few of them, with like the Jerboa especially, it's like beautiful, you can play as a Jerboa, you're actually a little, you look like a goddamn Pikachu. But first before we go into that, I'm going to go in as a Wild Riot, no, when you um, when you go Scorched Earth Custom Dino, Scorched Earth Custom Dino, I said when you go Scorched, you know it's supposed to pop something up, I'm just gonna imagine that it did anyways. It puts you in as a friggin' Death Worm, look at this, look at this dish, move us around, there we, there we go. The crappy thing is you actually can't pop out of the ground, so you're just like kind of a floored death worm. <laughs> but even then, we control where we go and everything, that's pretty fancy. I am the master of my own domain. I'm not sure if you can hurt things, actually, I haven't tried. I could imagine not, though, because, um, well, because we are in the freaking ground. I was like, earlier I did this for a second and I saw there was like a giant death worm in the sky. It's like he glitched where we were into the clouds. I want to see if I can get that going again too, because it was just cool to see the entire, like, the entire body of the death worm, like the butt to face. You never really see all of it, so it always stays dipped in the ground at least a tiny bit. Alright, Saber. See, it makes noises like we're attacking, but it's just not happening. It's just not a thing. It definitely sounds like we're doing something. The sand's moving around a good amount. Damn it, it's like it's so close to epic. Still though, still playing as a death worm. Still gonna control where the sand pile goes. Hang on. I'm gonna respawn a few times and eventually it might make that sky sandworm disappear up here again. That super glitch thing I was tripping out over. Damn it, I still think it's gonna happen. It was completely glitched and probably will never happen again. But whenever I'd come in as this creature, then it would just show a complete death worm like hanging limb just limp in the sky like a hundred feet to the above me but also to the right a bit it didn't make any damn sense at all whichever way i'd look around then it would change and it was like the game just like put my character up there for some reason but it was damn it it was sexy i never happened again all right whatever some things are just not meant to happen twice man they're too amazing even though it kind of did happen twice i'm kind of trying to see it a third time it's just all around weird all right okay cool so one thing before coming in as jerboa I haven't actually tried this either. I wonder if I could come in as a baby any of these. That would be... No, there's no way. There's no way the mod's that updated. Yeah, was, there's just... There's just no way. If anything, I just broke my computer. Oh, oh ha ha! I did break my computer. Why am I celebrating? Oh shit, it seems to work on this map. Hang on, I wonder if it'll work on Scorched Earth 2. Don't crap the game out, little guy. Don't do it. Yes, you can play as baby dragons. Oh, I'm just adorable. Adorably useless. Oh, it's cool to see me attack though as such a little turd. Oh no, I made a stink right in the middle of the house. This is why you can't have a baby one of these guys. All right, well then if we're here, then we could be on Scorched Earth. How are these not? It always bother me that you can't find these in Scorched Earth, like natural born baby dragons. They're just either eggs or full grown adults. Like the missing link does not exist. It's ridiculous. All right, time to try this back on Scorched Earth. It is a success here. All right, this time we're coming in as a baby. Are there ba There's no baby rock elementals. It does seem like mantises can't breed either, apparently. Those both seem like very funny ways to crash the game right now. I will like to experiment with that in a second. After I spawn in, is this little adorable fart? Oh, that's so cool. So you get to kind of half-ass play as a freaking death worm. You get to be baby dragons in first person. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Little dragon flames. But oh, we're so little. We're just a straight up dragon puppy. Feel like we have a while before we're no longer a dragon puppy too. Things are gonna be kind of crappy for a while. We have no one to wipe us either. How come the baby poison dragon can do his move, but the baby fire dragon can't do shiz? We're like an actual baby. We're worthless. Oh my god. All we can do is shit our pants and breastfeed. We have no place for us in nature. Yeah, you'd not last long as this guy. I wonder if, I wonder if the little lightning guy can do his- Oh god, baby Joe! 
Oh, I'm so cute and crash the game. Lightning, I think it's lightning that does it. Lightning baby, something with that. Yep, there it is. Oh, son of a balls, this is how you experiment. All right, well, we've seen how far we can push that. I'm just gonna see if I can push it one more time. Like a few things that I know you can't really be, but I wonder if I could just, if you could be it with this mod that you couldn't be normally, or that you couldn't normally create. Like I know there's obviously a baby manticore is gonna craft the game out. I've already played as a manticore many times, not played as one, but you could just kind of ride it into battle, which we've done a few times just in battle videos. I know there's no rock elemental babies. Er, I wonder what baby your bow is. Why can't you play as a vulture? I'd love to be a vulture right now. All right, baby rock elemental, do you exist? All right, I'm cute. I don't, I don't feel very babyish. <laughs> if this is an infant, I ripped my mother in two when I came out. Good God. All right, so it thinks I'm a baby. I'm just not. I'm just right center core. There you go. So it doesn't make you feel like you're a person on top of it. You just feel like, I actually do feel like I am this thing right now. I feel like I don't fit in anywhere. Later world. Oh, that's what, what? I, that, how do I go into a rock? Can I not go into a rock? Okay, yes, that's, that's how you throw rocks. Very good. Good boy. There's no... You gotta be able to go into a rock if you're this guy, though. That's the thing. That has to be a necessity. That's his whole escape plan in life. Just turn to a boulder. Alright, time to get a little real with this ish. Going in as a jerboa. Let's see what life's actually like for these little fellas. There we go. Now we actually are the dude. Oh, look at him back that ass up. Are you serious? He could moonwalk twerk? That is the craziest thing I've ever seen. Let's get back to the- <laughs> Look at this guy! He could make a killing in a titty bar! Good guy! I don't know, assuming people- may Maybe a weirdo one. A bestiality strip club, if those exist. Animal strip- Hey, that's a good business idea, man. There's sickos out there. There's animals that need to make a living. I think we're getting completely sidetracked on what's supposed to be happening here, but he's the one getting all funky. So, yeah, so here we are as a jerboa, which is- Which is cool! It's really cool because you can't be- Or you can't ride jerboas, obviously. Cause they're, they're, they're tiny as hell. They're like, no, you bitch! Oh, bottom of the food chain strikes again! I walked right up to it too, that was so dumb on my part. But yeah, so you actually feel like you are a Jerboa because this is the only way to be able to play this one. And it's also cool because they have a little attack. Look how cute that is. Like he's fierce. He thinks he's people. There you go, buddy, bite. Look at that little mouth. It like opens for a millisecond. Probably just to eat flies and shit. There we go, just... The, the first person's a little trippy. It's like located right in the center of his skull. We have the first person view of his brain, which usually can't really see things. It needs to be hooked up to the ocular receptors. So, um, let's just stay out of first person. It is awesome being smaller than the bushes, though. I'm not gonna lie. I do believe us to be excellent jumpers. Honestly, we do everything but conduct electricity. We are, we are Pikachu in an essence. Unfortunately, I wonder if they could breed. I doubt they could, though. I doubt that update would be ready yet. I'll try right now in a second. Oh god, I would just love to live on the mountainsides. This needs to be multiplayer so freaking bad because just imagine how cool it'd be if a few of your friends lived up here just as your boas on this mountainside. You kind of just like begin your little sneaky journey quest climb every day to get. How would you even get up here? How would you even get down? Oh, you see, no, there's, yeah, you just access your way along the bridge or whatever. But basically, it'd be the best place to exist. Nothing would ever even try to hunt you and your people except for things that are flying over. Because it's like, it's so on the cliffside, you'd be chilling, and then you could just hide in the bushes. It'd just be great to have at least three, four people in a world, everyone role-playing as different creatures. Oh, balls. Okay, we'd have to make base somewhere else. Oh, no, this is where we drop one of our children, our bet. There would, or I bet, there wouldn't be no way to rescue them. Never mind, this is, this is a movie waiting to happen right here. What would you do? I would need like animal surgeon and rescue. <laughs> you gotta be screwed. Oh, it's so sad to think how many animals probably died like that. All right, going down. There was no need to jump first to make it worse for yourself. Eesh. Oh hell yeah. We took it like a sir. We hit it at an angle, so it didn't kill us. We also patched the no oh, shit snake. Oh my god, that would be like the worst fear ever right there. Is a giant snake. Oh my god, we're just like a giant rat. Uh, this is like we are we are prime dining for that fool There would be no surrender like this. We could attack though. We could fiercely We could put up a fight All right, what's our choice what's our chance for survival here? We're not gonna beat him in a foot race even though we kind of are I think if I just climb a rock Then I'll defeat him Oh, he's focused on something else. Oh, it curled up in a ball. Aha! I don't have to be faster than him I just have to be faster than everybody else and that would be the death of me 
I don't know, I might be safe in this little hole. As a Jaboa, you're so, like, agile and small, you can pretty much fit in anywhere. Crawl up a dead creature's rectum if the times call for it. Alright, yeah, it's hard. It's, you can't breed it. Here I am as a female Jerboa. It would say, like, find a mate to enable breeding in the bottom left corner if I could breed. So I can't. Unfortunately, we are doomed to a life of, I guess, just survival without the benefits of th this pretty great life. I don't know. I feel like I would not mind being sterile myself. I would. <laughs> All right. Moment of truth. Coming in as a, no, no, no. Coming in as a scorched earth baby. God, I want to see. Okay, I'm going to, I can't let myself rest. Unless I can see if you can be a baby mantis. See, I know you couldn't because you can't even breed mantises apparently. So why would there be babies? But, I mean, damn it, it was worth a shot, alright? Now everyone, no one's gonna comment down below like, Johnny, right, you couldn't have at least tried? You lazy bastard. Oh god, this is how the game keeps crashing. It says I'm dead, but I'm alive. And then it just poops out. Watch, three, two, one. Oh, damn! Alright, now for the moment we've all been waiting for. The baby Jerboa survival. No more screw- Yeah, look at this little fart shit! Oh my god, we move at micro speeds. Okay, there we go. Oh my god, that is the cutest little thing ever. Look at his little boots. <laughs> Look at this little- Oh my god, that water bug looks terrifying from down here. You gargantuan beast. Look at this. I guess they could feed me for- I would, I would confuse it for my mother. I'd be like, that's my mother's breast, I'm pretty sure. I don't know what that horrible alien looking creature thing carrying it is, but that's my mother's breast. Eh, I don't know. It's a giant bulbous thing that excretes liquids. That's why a child would think that. I, I had to explain myself. <laughs> Look how little I am. Oh my god. It's so funny. What am I, what's my plans in life? You gotta keep me warm, water bug. You're my parent now. You're my only friend. Look at those big eyes. Yeah, you better run, pussy! I'm actually kinda, I have a little attack apparently. We can nibble. This thing would definitely give you, like, freaking rabies or something. Like, oh, something bit me. God, like, how little we are. We could live in the hollow spots of this log. We'd surely starve and die soon, though. We are, like, the, we are the definition of food in these days, no doubt. We'd get picked off by a vulture so freaking... Argentavis wouldn't even bother with us. Because it would take more calories to swoop down and eat us than we would deliver through eating. But a vulture would not care at all. They, like... They get off on that kind of weird stuff. I'm gonna fight this guy right now. I would die. I would. <laughs> well, of course I'll die. It doesn't take it. Doesn't take common sense to tell you that much. All I know is I can hit, and this guy looks like a straight up weenie. Oh, oh, not nearly as effective. Yeah, you better run, chicken shit. Hang on. Oh, we could jump. Oh, the world is in our hands. Oh, it's all. It's all over now. Oh, look at all that bloody just spewed. Yeah, sucker. And I leveled up. Oh my god, what if I kill him right now? Oh my god, my stamina's out. Well, if fortune should have it, he can't find us in this bush. So we're chilling. Oh, you can run, but you can't hide! Rah! It's over now. Oh, your days are numbered. Your did It's scared of me! What the hell's going on around here? Why art thou- I can't even hit it. I'm so little. I can't find his damage indicator. You're lucky. You're lucky it's past my bedtime. Ew, look, I'm just like caving out a little hole in the bottom of his stomach lining. That's disgusting. I'm like, ew, dude, that's like, look, I'm covered in his blood. Jesus Christ. It's like one of those movies where like a, a rat or something burrows into him horribly. Gee, what was that one movie? It was like Bad Boys or something where they put like a rat on his stomach with a, with a tin can around it and then lit a blowtorch to the tin can so the rat had nowhere to go to barrow down through the guy's stomach. That's exactly what's happening right now. Dude, I haven't activated a single dev command to protect me whatsoever. That's why I've been dying constantly as all the other creatures. And this is just hilarious right here. I think we're just too small. Or he's just like, or, or she, she's, she's just overrun with motherly instinct and refuses to squash kids. But I mean, at a certain point, I don't want to punch kids either. But if they got me down to where I was about to die because they were eating me, I would kick the shit out of those kids. I would punch them across a football field. Oh my god, I'd be like, I'd be like, all right, they're all, they're all just footballs. Just look at them all as footballs, Johnny. You'll walk out of here just fine. What? How did I die? I was doing fine. I was doing great down there. Well, I think he stepped on us or something. <laughs> Unless I didn't notice something. I thought we were ahead. We were doing good down there, but no. Apparently, there was a major flaw in my plan. 
All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up here since this pretty much summarizes the newest joy of the play as Dynamod, where all these Scorched Earth creatures are included. Some of them very buggy, some of them awesome. Baby Jerboa, awesome. Baby Dragon's awesome. Freaking playing as partially as the Death Worm, freaking sweet. The whole thing was actually pretty exciting. A good use of my time. So, yeah, if you want to download the link that's in the description below, if you had a good time watching, smack that like button, subscribe for more, and I'll see you next time. Peace!